Hello, I'm Daria Wasserbach, the superintendent of Delaware Valley Regional High School. On behalf of our faculty and staff, I'd like to welcome you back, both our students and their families. Now, as I'm sure you all know, we are about to launch the most unique school opening in our history. You've heard us repeatedly say that the highest priority is the health and safety of our staff and students, and it is. We have spent thousands of hours planning to make sure this school year will allow you to achieve your fullest potential while maintaining a safe environment. Now, no one can make any guarantees, but I will share with you the measures we have been taking to mitigate risks to health and safety. We have continually followed the guidelines issued by the Governor's Executive Orders, the New Jersey Department of Education, the Department of Health, and the CDC. Our first priority is to limit the number of individuals in the building on any given day. Approximately 200 students have opted for full-time remote learning, leaving about 550 students returning to the building for in-person instruction. It's important to note that full-time remote learners will follow the same full-day, eight-period bell schedule as their in-person classmates. Students will be learning synchronously both in and outside of the classroom. Every student at Del Val has been assigned to the blue team or the gold team, and we've created an alternating or hybrid schedule, which will continue until we can safely adjust our schedule accordingly. For in-person learners, lunch will be broken down into two groups with two different assigned eating areas, the cafeteria and the gold gym. Masks are required to be worn at all times. This includes on the bus, entering and exiting the building, and throughout the entire school day. Recent guidelines have identified restricted face coverings that are not considered acceptable in effectively reducing the transmission of COVID-19. DelVal will not allow anyone to wear neck gaiters, bandanas, or masks with valves. That includes N95s or KN95s while in our building. Hand sanitizers are available in every classroom and stations are strategically located throughout the facility. Water filling stations are also available throughout the facility and students are encouraged to bring a water bottle to school. Electrostatic disinfectant sprayers have been purchased for every room. Classrooms will be disinfected at the end of each period and will be thoroughly cleaned and disinfected at least once each day. Throughout the facility, you'll find new signs and directions reminding students to wear their masks, socially distance, and to obey the new traffic rules. Del Val ensures that the indoor facilities have adequate ventilation, including operational heating and ventilation systems where appropriate. We take the threat of COVID-19 very seriously. If your child is exhibiting symptoms, it is important to keep him or her home from school. Anyone displaying symptoms will be sent home immediately with directions to follow up with their physician. Additional information relating to curriculum, instruction, assessment, and student life will be forthcoming from our school leaders, so please be sure to check your emails frequently. You can find all of this information and more on our Return to School website, accessible from the shortcut menu on our homepage. So whether you have chosen to be full-time remote or in-person learner, we all wish you much success this school year.